Hello and welcome everybody. My name is Geo from SwitchRPG.com. We are playing Star Renegades here today. We just activated this droid. If you're not sure why we have this droid, please go to the previous episode and follow along. But we got to escape here, so let's get out of here. Let's go, let's go. Oh, weird that we have to push the button to get through the door. Okay, so at least it's kind of zoned off a little bit. Let's get out of here. Whoa! What the heck? These buildings usually aren't on fire. <laughs> okay, that's good. The attack just ended. But they'll be back soon to finish the job, so we have to hurry. The entry point is right over there. Alright, but I but I wanna see I wanna see what is you up there. Man, there's all sorts of stuff happening. All right, let's go. Pay attention, J5. You need to walk through this portal and deliver a very important message for me. Is this like R2-D2? Find Professor Zurich. They're the only person I can trust. They might be a little testy, but that's how geniuses are sometimes. Find them and play this message I gave you. Can you do that? Come on, Justin. Yes, he can do that. I'll take that as a yes. Countless lives depending on... Countless lives depending on you doing that, though... Try not to... Try not to let that give you a big head or sphere, I suppose. Sorry, I was a little distracted there. Go through the portal when you're ready. What's that? Don't worry about me. Your mission is the only thing that matters anymore. Enter portal. Okay. Let's go. Come on. Come on. He made it. Well, you don't know if he made it. He just disappeared. Oh, gee. Holy cow. You are surrounded. There you are. Well, what are you waiting for? You got me, haven't you? Don't tell me I gotta take on all these things. That just seems very silly. Many of you have told me what Davion meant to you. For that, I thank you. I only wish Davion were here so he could tell you directly. So you could tell him directly. Thank you, and A moment of silence for our fallen Wario, please. Wario? Warrior. Alright, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Can I go here? Citizens. Hello, citizen. Citizen, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. I just ran over everyone there. Oh, I'm trying to get to that dude. Not happening. Let's go in the building. Now on to the business at hand. Some of you approached me wondering what the council plans to do with these raiders. The ones that destroyed the armada and killed Colonel Syphex. And as a member of the Joint Chiefs, let me just say we have a plan. We will rebuild the Amara stronger than ever, and we'll send that vessel back to hell it came from. All right, I'm in the lab. What did I say about not being? Come here, give me whatever message you have. Okay, I'll, I'll do what you say. I'm in the middle of studying the most important unexplainable quantum phenomenon of my career. So whatever it is, whatever this is, I hope it's a re I hope it's reality shattering. Hello, Dr. Zarek. Wait, what? Okay, I guess that counts. I'm so confused. We have Professor Zarek and Dr. Zarek. Let's cut to the chase. I'm you and you're me. We're from different realities. I know this is highly confusing, even to you. I've sent this hyper-advanced servo bot across the quantum divide to warn you. Your, re your reality is under attack, even as we speak. Does this have anything to do with... The Q-71 entanglement phenomenon you detected over Norosh precisely. You've certainly alerted the Star Union Council... 
and they've dispatched the Armada to investigate. You'll learn very soon that the Armada has been destroyed by a starship of unimaginable power cloaked in the entanglement. This ship is from another reality, and its goal is to conquer your entire galaxy. I know, because they've already conquered mine. I've got to. Warn them, it's far too late. But when the council calls you seeking your brilliant expertise on parallel re realities, you'll need to have a plan ready. And that's where I come in. I know these invaders' next move and how you can stop them. If you follow my lead, your world has a shot. But if you fail, promise me you'll send Justin through the next reality they invade because they will never stop. Now listen up, here's the plan. The first step is this. Reach out to General Geddon and play him this message. You'll need to explain to him. You'll you'll need to explain it to him. But he'll help you form the kind of task force necessary to bring this invasion down. Wait, what? Huh? Whoa. Are these the different realities? I guess I'm going here. I'm not sure what happened there. Like, was there supposed to be another page there that I missed the... I must have clicked the wrong button. I don't know. Mother. You look especially pretty today. Oh, is this the, the next guy we're going to get killed? We're going to kill this guy. All right, so, yes, I've inspected him. Can I go? Am I at your planet? Let's go. Let's do this. All right, well, here we are. There we are. Sorry about that. The engineer said the landing would be smoother. So I'm so, I, I must have selected the wrong button because here we have our party that uh, that they were going to talk about. Anyway, I've gone through worse landings lately. As long as you and Justin survived, it's a success in my book. You should help your companions with their pods. It seems they're having a little trouble with their hatches. Okay. I can do that. Open. Zerks. Nerza joins the Renegades. How was the trip? All praise Lord Botula for delivering us safely to the battlefields. Yeah, yeah. Titans be praised, etc. Yeah, you get it. Look, you're not going to try and convert me again, are you? All right. Next. Is this always random? I wonder if this is always random. Right. Star-Lord? I'm locked and loaded, ready to roll out. Let's smoke these bogeys. What are you doing? Just talking like a space marine. Don't like it? I can switch to Nodo normal style. Yeah, why don't you do that? No problemo. Enough to chat. Move out and take control of that Imperium base. Kill anything that slows you down. Don't get cocky. One of their elite officers will be stationed at the base, and you'll have to go through him. We'll be in contact to provide mission specs along the way. Now, lock and load, boyos. Time to tag and bag some Imperium Jones. Now roll out. All right, cool. See, yeah, yeah, that's not how we talk. My spiritual teachings tell me that both paths are favored for our objective. Your wisdom clearly knows no bounds. Psst, boss lady. Just so you know, these fundamentalists aren't big on sarca sarcasm. This is true. We preach a radical form of honest discourse, devoid of exaggeration or any form of subtlety. You do? No, that was my demonstration of sarcasm to you, idiot human. Oh no, not bad. All right. That was weird. All right, cool. Um, can we, anything down this way? All right, so there's 
There's one dude. Mach 1 Robo Soldier. Ooh, contains DNA. Maybe we can and should go down that way. Or maybe that's the way we're supposed to go. A wyvern. So I'm not sure if, if the point is to go down there or maybe just travel right away. Get that dude and... Who dispenser? Where's the where's the bad dude? Oh, there he is. All right, cool. So there's a quite a bunch of ways we can get around. So let's let's just do that. Let's go get this guy. Are there two enemies there? Or is it a normal? There, there are two enemies. Alright, I want to attack this one and get a break on them. And then we'll do that. That'll move that one 10 seconds. And we'll... Hopefully get a break on that one, too. We'll see what happens. I could have examined them, but I didn't. All right. We got shields down on, on the both of them. Whoa. That don't... Did that already kill someone? Looks like it might have downed someone. That's not good. All right. Let's inspect these things. 25% versus marked. I'm not sure what all of these things are. I'm trying to look at those effects. I'm not... I don't know what that is. Oh, flying. Grounded when stunned. Okay. Let's do some heavy damage. On you. Yeah, you need help, my friend. Alright, let's see what this does. He's dead. Or not. Um, I was reading it's the pink is his health, but he definitely does need shields back anyway. Cool, one down. Let's take this thinking thing out. Armor break, beautiful. Sweet. All right, we got some DNA. Not sure what that does. I'm guessing. Ugh, the creatures from this dimension are hideous. Talk about us. All right, there's a Titan Hammer. I kind of want to get this food. That looks like important. Take food. Ah, cool. Uh, resistance to concussion, 25%, and rattled for two combats. Exhaust this when used. So here are our cards. Nice. Can I go back here? Oh, no. All right. Well, I went the chose the wrong path. I kind of wanted to go down. That's okay. That is all right. Let's get this wyvern. Let's try and not get so much damage on that dude. I have a lot of damage on him. Hmm. Okay. Still don't know what they're weak to. 
Let's go normal attack on this dude here. That's That'll push him that way. And then we do need to try and break him. This should break him. Okay. And then... Reduce defense. That's kind of not good. But man, it will break you. Yeah, that's not enough there. That is enough to break. So we'll see what happens here. That is a cool move. All right, shields down. You're broken. All right, so do we just focus fire here? Will that kill you? That might kill you. That might kill you. Um... Well, let's see what happens here. Might kill one, but they might get a shot off. Yeah. Wow. Plus shield damage. Alright, one down. I don't know how the turn order is distinguished here. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't know when my guys go and then their guys go. It's just in the timeline there. I'm not, not entirely sure. If I missed that in the lesson. All right, let's... let's I want to get a late kill, so somebody... So maybe it just doesn't, doesn't tell you. That's okay. Who needs a shield? We all need shields, actually. So just is that just do it to all of us? Well, either way, you really need shields. Oh, that might kill you right away. Never mind. Wow, that is awesome. Yeah, you never you never got the chance. Goodbye. Cool. So, I don't think we heal up, but our shields get get back up. And I'm okay with that. Ah, gee. I wonder what this giant gun symbolizes. Bad time for the Imperium to take a bathroom break. Now we have their guns. I have to admit, I'm envious of the size of their gun. Level up. Mm hmm. All right, that's what we use DNA for. When you've obtained enough DNA, you can use it to level up your heroes. Level Levels are reset when you return to the Renegade base and jump to the next dimension. Use DNA, DNA to decide who you want to level up. Leveling up will increase health, damage, and possi possibly grant a new power or camping card. Potential new powers or cards are displayed in the Heroes Details panel. All right. Who do I want to level up? You would seem to get the most reward for it. Let's battle cry taunt enemy. I don't want to do that. But I do. I choose you. I, I got nothing in here. No equipment. Normal stuff. Oh, I do have a card. Heal for 50. I don't want to use that on you, to be honest with you. But yeah, let's uh, let's level up you. Level two, plus thirty health, new power battle cry. So it's a taunt. So kind of need it with the you know, if you're gonna taunt, you're gonna need more health. Uh, so we only have three more DNA, not enough to really do anything else. So let's resume game. We can just jump. 
a gift from the Titans to help us cleanse the Holy Land of Heathen Imperium. What is that? Open crate. New gear! Alright, so what do we want? Plus 10 health. These are all common. Uh, penetrates armor, 25% inflicts burning. That looks cool. Oh, wait, there are... Oh, no, I was going to say it. But it said side effects. Uh, blocked by shields. Hmm. I do really like this. Who am I going to give that to, though? Impressive technology, yet a curse nonetheless. Imperium tech is more advanced than ours in every way, so feel free to steal anything you can. I wouldn't mind the opportunity to analyze it. Did you say steal? Now you're speaking my lingo. Great tech, but has anyone noticed that the Imperium soldiers are a little off? My best guess is that the cross-quantum journey takes a toll on brain functions. This would explain why they're networked into an advanced AI neural set, neural net. Although it's anyone's guess why they refer to this AI as mother. Tough guys always talk about their moms, but not me. I was born in a cloning vat. I wouldn't exactly characterize myself as tough. All right. Now, what I do want to know is how do how do how am I sure that was equipped and who it was equipped to? So let's go to squad. Uh, let's take a look at here. Here's the equipment. How do I just swap over? All right, there we go. Oh, so it went to you. All right, that's fine. That is fine. Oh, wow. Looks like we're getting right into that. All right, let's go. I was hoping to do a little more stuff. Ugh, these creatures, creatures from this dimension are hideous. Oh, hopefully we don't die to this thing. What? You got to jump on us? Now you shall feel the full extent of my righteous anger. Don't you dare. Alright, well these things are like freaking ready. Alright. Let's... This doesn't move any... No, it does... Yeah, it does move time. I don't know if that breaks anybody though. Needs to return fire. I don't like that at all. Can I just slash? He's just on Overwatch. All right. Hmm. Let's see if we can break this thinking thing. All right. Well, it's broken. Shields down already. What I'm trying to do is I want to take that that flying thing out. In Mother's name, I smite you. All right, that'll kill you. You stow shields. You really need it. And let's try and get you, your arc defense down. Nice. Shields up. Man, that guy does a ton of damage, too. Alright, well, his armor's not down, but his shields are down. A strong blast. This is going to taunt the enemy. Not quite what I want to do right now. Let's see if we can break them. Oh, not quite. That'll break them. My fury is pretty high right now. I don't see any teamwork abilities yet. All right, his armor's done.
I'm I'm getting it now, guys. Okay, so maybe I missed this, but if you look on the ability on the top right, or it says slash normal, the top right there's like a clock icon. It looks like this one takes a little bit longer to do. All right, maybe okay, yeah. I just wasn't paying attention. That might have been it because I'm looking at the icon where it ends up going. Like, this one takes a while to do. I mean, it makes sense. But then there... Okay. Alright. It's getting there. I'm getting there. It's making sense a little bit. So this is a short, shorter attack. Let's get that moving. Light attack. Which is good. Which is nice. Let's just do this. Let's get some damage on this thing. It's making sense now. So as it progresses, it goes in that turn. Got it. I got it. Oh, you should be dead soon. Mother, save me. <laughs> Retreat? What? You ain't retreating nothing, dude. You're gonna die today. I want to make again. I want to make sure that these turns are sooner rather than later. Discharge is all I can do, huh? I'm cool with that. Let's go. Let us... Is this what I want? What does more damage? Okay. Yeah, that's what I want. Boomba. Eliminated. Nice. We survived. Somehow. But I was just getting started. Killed. Dead ski. Oh, don't want to miss this. Gain equipment. New gear. All right, common sword. All right, tells you on the bottom who it's going for. All right. Plus 10% damage to all attacks. This guy's going to be a beast, but it can only put on three pieces at a time, right? Penetrates armor, inflicts burning. We kind of already have that. Five seconds of stagger. I like that. Great job. You've sliced and diced those bogeys. Now that their base belongs to you, you've earned the break. Set up camp. Get some rest. And we'll push on in the next, in the morning. Okay. Camping. Camping allows your heroes to rest and gain affection for each other. Each hero has their own set of camping cards that they can play on themselves or other heroes. Camping cards cost action points and you can... Gr and can grant special status effects, regenerate lost health, repair armor, and can increase affection between heroes. Action points are shared between all heroes and cards. Can vary in their action point cost. Once you've, once you've used up all your action points, your squad will go to sleep. As your heroes gain affection for each other, they strengthen their relationship and unlock conversations and bonus like and bonuses like beneficial traits, combo powers, and sometimes even new progeny heroes. Hmm. All right, I only have this one card. This heals everybody. Everybody? Oh, I gotta decide who I would want to use it on. Yeah, it's gotta be... No, it's gotta be you, right? Here you go. Aww. What else can I do? I have no cards. I can't do anything. I'm moving my cursor. I got nothing. Alright. He's still... I understand that. I can't... I can't do anything. 
cycle unit. Oh, I can. I, was, I thought I hit cycle units. All right. So 30% max shields last two combats. That's pretty good. Resistance to concussion. I don't think we've needed to do this yet. So let's go for you. 30% max shields. Yeah. Let's use that on you. Considering you're the tank person. Let's save that. Attack drain shields last two combats. Okay. So let's use that on you. We're going to all be friends. Isn't that fun? Alright, now we... I mean, we have one more card available, but we have no action points. Oh, this one costs zero. Maybe. I don't know. I don't want to use it right now. Let's get out of here. You still have zero points available. Yeah, okay. Let's go. Dang, now we've seen everybody. <laughs> Mother, give me your orders and I will carry them out to the best of my ability. Dang. Well, we definitely have... We're not going to be going after that dude yet. So we, I don't feel like we're there yet. Obviously, we're going to be going after you. All right, cool. But that's actually going to do it for today's episode. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. And join me next time. Goodbye.